Fabio De Chimero. Catch a fire. Yeah. Belfano. What you know? What you know? Ah, this is out of it. It's out of it, man. We finally got here. We're finally here. What's up, bro? A lot of Brazilians in New Zealand and, and in our travels around the world are always saying that they have prisons here. Their people are just like our people, you know, just like the Maldives, you know. We um, like to party, like to sing, like to dance, you know, and that just comes naturally. Come only 6:30, and they will send it to the hotel. We're used to doing a show and then having a couple of hours sleep, then up again. Over here, it's not five hours, it's ten hours, you know, fifteen hours driving. So the bus was a nice touch. A lot of driving, gig, then drive, gig, yeah, full on. Recline, wake up ten hours later, semi refreshed, and you know, in the next, the next point of call. Really good, good addition.
States. The atmosphere there, seeing the people reacting to our music for the first time at a major festival, you know, we probably had a good 5,000 people standing in front of us. I thought it was amazing coming here to see that. Uh, we got to go and hang out with Nutty Roots for a little bit. It's kind of a kind of sushi. Look at this, it is a boat of sushi. It's a boat of sushi. It's like Noah's Ark, it's beautiful. Nice to hang out with the boys again, Nutty Roots. We've uh, hosted them in New Zealand. Saudi! Alex, the lead singer asked me to, to hop on stage and, and sing a song with them. Drink some water! Alright, boom! I didn't even know what key they, they sung it in and stuff. I was like, what key, what key? And they, they were saying, la, la. And I was like, you know, what's la? And nobody around us knew knew how to how to translate la. Because have a little thing, it's gonna be alright. I hear the B part. Yep. You rise up and in, 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 uh, in. You do the B part. Smile at the rising sun. The stage is it's yours. <laughs> There's a good vibe on, we've got amongst the rider. A good marker is when you see the, the bottle of tequila get pounded in like two minutes. This is the rhythm of a fire, yeah. This is the rhythm of a One experience like that can can change it, you know, can can make you feel a lot more fulfilled in, in what we're doing out here. Whoa, na, 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 na. I want you to sing it, Kurachiba. Come on, na, na, na. louder, please. Whoa, na, 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 na. Here we go. There's nothing more fulfilling as an artist to see that. And, and especially coming to another part of the world you've never been to before. It doesn't speak English.
be an eye-opener. My initial expectation of it was um, was pretty negative. One of my one of my friends, my good friends, come here. They got held up by a knife point. We're going to start a trail to the very top of the Two Brothers Hill. It's an amazing, amazing place to see uh, all the South Zone of Rio. It's a unique place. You won't find uh, this trail in guidebooks in Lonely Planet. It's just for locals. This is my Mickey my Walker. Conditioning, an attachment to the roof, that's all you need, all you need. Nice. What would you do with that, eh? Security measures, bro. Definitely get a sense that we're in a different kind of ghetto around here, eh? He's a bit of a drummer as well and, and a little bit of a vocalist. I met him in the bar, went up to his pad, set the drums up and started playing away there and the next thing you know he started doing a impromptu vocal I guess you could say. We've got our own little motorcycle gang together. It's called the Vavella Riders. Pretty freaky. It's the first time I've seen anything like this. All these fellas just chilling out on bikes, waiting to take people up the Vavellas. It's gonna be a cool experience, bro. Can't wait. I think, we, I think we've got too much help right about now, eh? Keeps the house better than none, I suppose. Jandals, bro. Oh my word. I'm a musician. Man. Yeah. Holy cow. 350,000 people live down there. On the road with the pops. Nothing like it. Jiggle was taken out like Open Oni Iron Man, Hokianga Iron Man. Almost died, bro. You almost got bitten by a snake. Fucking big snake, bro. Looks like a log of wood, but it's moving. It's always an era of danger. What we do. I 
abraço, ó. E aí, eu falei, gente. We're playing at the tennis club and I thought to myself, that's a cool name for a club, but it, it actually is a tennis club. Getting out of the van, a car driving past, tooting away, going, catch a fire, and you're just like, the hell have you heard about us, you know, uh, over here, so. Since we got here, we've been here for at least a couple of hours, and God knows how long we've been sitting here before we arrived here. But we've got two more signatures to get Logan and Jordan's. Two drummers, eh? Two drummers. Sick of taking pictures. I think it comes with the territory, really, you know. It's part of your job. Oi, wait, wait, on. It was our last gig last night and 15, 20 people packed into our green room. Coming in, full blown jam. Celebrating Honey's birthday. I don't remember. <laughs> oh, was it on my birthday? Yeah. For that time around, uh, you drink. <laughs> Então foi essa foi a primeira música que eu que eu conheci deles. Das pessoas e todas elas gostaram muito, né, da, das melodias, das canções, dos vocais, né, da qualidade musical deles. Então eles têm tudo para poder realmente fazer carreira no Brasil, porque o brasileiro aceita de uma forma muito interessante as músicas que são cantadas em inglês. Falou, irmão. Let us 
got a bit of brown bits, but what would life be without brown bits, eh?